get to the video. Oh, I just like spit everywhere. That's nasty. Okay. Hey, everybody. So this is my makeup container thingy. And it is, <clears throat> sorry. And this is the Alex edition. And you can find these at Ikea. And um, I actually stacked two of them because they only go to about, see where that line is in between those two top drawers right there? That is how tall they are. So I definitely needed a lot more um, drawers because my collection did extend. So I decided to buy two of them and it is a space saver. Trust me, it's definitely worth buying. And if you're wondering where I got that little Paris Eiffel Tower, I got it at, ooh, okay, I, wait, <laughs> I got it at Hobby Lobby. Yeah, that's where I got it. And this little guy right here, I got him at TJ Maxx on sale. Okay. So I'm going to start my collection right here and this is my cute little brush setup and also perfumes and I do have my moisturizer and if you did not watch my favorite beauty products this is the Clinique moisturizer. Moisturizer. <laughs> Sorry I don't know why I'm putting that in there but yeah. And here is the Urban Decay um, Marshmallow Body Glitter. And it smells so good. It smells like marshmallows. I also have all of my perfumes. My DKNY. Forgot which ones this is. Coach. Steel. Chanel. Juicy. Betsy Johnson. Gucci, Gucci, um, Dolce & Gabbana, <laughs> and some more Gucci. I wonder why I named my dog Gucci. Okay, but yeah, those are the perfumes I have set up here because they are some of my favorites. I also got this cute little candle holder that looks like that, and I'm also using a fake candle because I don't like tea lights they don't burn they like burn out so fast and they're really wasteful in my opinion so I use these little fake ones and it's dirty don't mind okay so I'm gonna show you some of my brushes I do have a variety of different brands and different kinds so you can see my hard goes these are the cutest brushes I've ever seen in my little life. I love them. You can find those at Sephora. Definitely so worth it. They're so cute. And also the large brush is amazing. I have Sonia Kesha's. Also some CVS's. Max. Um, Sephora's. All type of different brands. Also eco-friendlies. And I found this really, really cute flower brush at, where did I find this? At TJ Maxx. And it seems to be by this person, Amy B. And it has a flower. That's why I bought it. It was so cute. I don't even know if I'm going to use it because, well, it's really soft, actually. I might, but I don't want to mess that up. <laughs> okay, um, Sunny Kesha's and also my Mac Kabuki. I just love saying that kabuki. Okay, and then these are pretty much most of my powder brushes, my larger brushes, and then we're gonna go on to all of my brushes that are more smaller, foundation. Also, uh, oh, I do have those over there actually. My, um, <clears throat> what am I gonna tell you? Crap. My concealer brushes, and also all of my eyeshadow brushes 
And also in here we have a variety of different brands. I can't even remember most of them. Good Variety or MAC. Good Variety are also um, CVS. I love those brushes. And Sonia Kesha, of course. And some of them are uh, miscellaneous that I do not remember where the heck I bought them. And these glass holders, if you're wondering... Oh, did I tell you where I got that? I think I did. I got these um, accessories. The little diamond stone thingies, the little uh, paperweights, also the mirror that I have my perfume on, and also the glass containers that I have all my brushes in and the beads that went inside to keep the brushes together. I got them all at Michael's and also my cute little flower arrangement at Michael's and that too. So it's a definitely a great place to buy some stuff to decorate with. Okay, so I'm going to start off with some drawers so you can actually see the makeup. I'm not going to show you the first drawer because I'm still in the process of organizing it. Plus there's no makeup in it, so it's just junk. Okay, in here I have all of my eye products not specifically organized the way it should be but it's just a little something to show. I have my eyeliners, my eyelash curlers, eyebrow stuff, grooming, also some eyelash glue. I have a lot of little color eyeliners. Usually I don't really use them too much but still is really awesome stuff to have plus I'm a makeup hoarder so of course I'm gonna hoard makeup that I don't need but you know that's why you're on YouTube gotta love makeup on here especially the beauty community I have all of my mascaras right here and I get my organizers at Target. I believe that's where I got this one too. No, I got this at Bed Bath & Beyond and I got this larger one at Target. Moving on. In here I have my variety of eyelashes. I have my lineup of NYX. Some Halloween ones back there that I never used and I don't know when. I believe I got my bottom eyelashes, the um, these kind, I got them at Sally's Beauty Supply, and I have my Elfs, which are only a dollar, so they're totally worth it. And I have my Sephora, my Sephora is right here. Some more Sephora's and Elfs. Bottom eyelashes that you could find at Sally's, our beauty supply stores. And I have my eBay bulk eyelashes lined up and also some used eyelashes that I do want to reuse again because they're not worth throwing away. So, yeah. My collection of eyelashes. Okay, in here I have all of my variety of small um, eyeshadows and jumble pencils and everything pretty much for eyeshadow <laughs> applications. And I'll start over here. Think about giving that away. I have a lot of just the little singles, different brands. These are definitely the, um, this is kind of more of the drugstore brands. All my hips, the duos, different colors, varieties, pigments, and also what are these? Gel liners and a base. 
And right here, I have a lot of my smaller palettes, NYX, Jean, just different type of small palettes. Uh, Physician's Formula. So those are all my palettes. And I have some more small palettes, Cover Girls, just pretty much, I think they're all Cover Girls actually. Positions formula and just some smaller stuff glitter that <laughs> and right here is my Mac stuff and also Sephora Too Faced Urban Decay just a little bit more of the higher brands right here which I don't buy a lot of but yeah and some glitters more glitter other palettes and miscellaneous more palettes these are the wet n wild cream palettes I have a lot of my NYX jumbo pencils also some Milani glitter stuff to put on your eyes and these are the max factor which are no longer selling so you might have to eBay to find these anymore which made me really sad that they discontinued that line but what can you do so those are that moving on in here I have all of my larger palettes I um, bought this off of hotlook.com and they have sales every day if you haven't heard about them they're definitely awesome to check out daily and um, this is a humongous palette and I believe it was like over a hundred and something but it was on sale for definitely not even close to a hundred bucks it was a lot cheaper than that and it's pretty messy right now but ignore my Too Faced, Shady Lady, um, Urban Decays, Make It, also Midnight Cowboy, Red Gingers, these are very uh, similar to Coastal Scents, but yeah, uh, Bitch Slaps cosmetic palettes, and those are all my higher end palettes, and moving on to this drawer, I have my NYX Glitter Palette, the old Coastal Scents, when they first came out and I first heard about them, they did not have their logo, so uh, these are super old icings and also my elf beauty book books beauty books and yeah you can get those at target most of the time and i also have my makeup in a box by nyx and this is the bronzy one too got those off hot look so yeah okay now we're going to the bottom half And in here, it looks craziness because I am a hoarder of concealers and all that great stuff. Right here, I have all of my um, liquid concealers, pretty much. And these type of dispensers. I love NYX concealers. I also have my highlighters. And a lot of my lipstick concealers right here and right here I have a lot of my cream concealers that come in these type of tubes and as we move up here I got my primers some more primers and also my makeup forever setting powder my fix plus and my D stick sprays and this one's the all-nighter but I don't use that as much because I rather use my D stick spray and right here I have a lot of that doesn't belong in there I have a lot of my highlighters or illuminizers right here Smashbox Victoria's Secret also some more Smashbox. And up here I have some more luminizers. 
because I'm a freak at this stuff. I love it. Smashbox, and I got this one at Sally's Beauty Supply. Get Radiant. And these are some MAC little illuminizers as well. These are pretty awesome. Some NYX. These are the purple color that I absolutely love. Smashbox Primer. Bobbi Brown. And these are all my jar concealers right here. And some of what is this called again? Studio Secrets by L'Oreal Paris. Mixed glitter and miscellaneous stuff. Okay. Right here is my foundations. This is pretty much the side that I don't use. And I have my NARS Makeup Forever Sephora Makeup Forever MAC Miscellaneous um, Revlon MAC all miscellaneous too. Okay, I am a lip gloss hoarder. I absolutely collect it. I love it because I want every single shade I could find. And most of these NYX lip glosses I got on Hot Look because they do come in bulk and you can buy them for super cheap. So those are all of my shades in different variety sizes and that's all NYX. And right here I have a variety of different lip glosses that are all the same style of applying it on. And I have a lot of my beauty rushes and all my tube lip glosses in these two container thingies. And I have some lip scrub and also some extra bombs and all that great stuff right there. I have these style of lip glosses in here that come in this type of tube. Same thing. And back here are a lot of the miscellaneous type of lip glosses. So I have them all categorized in the type of tube that they're in. So that's what that is. And this is also some lip balm. Okay, moving on. Down here, I have my lipsticks. I have all of my MAC lipsticks right here. Most of them, here's a little MAC lipstick that got into this mixture of lipsticks. I have all types of different shades and varieties. These are, what are these called again? These are those lip uh, pots. Some more lipsticks, lipsticks, and more like the Wet n Wild lipsticks that are super cheap, but also pretty awesome. And right here I have a lot of my NYX lipsticks. Max Factor, which is no longer available. May have to try out... Um, God, I'm having braid, uh, brain farts. I don't know why. You have to try out eBay. Have some Revlons, CoverGirl, and also my Makeup Forever. Some more of my NYX, and these are the matte collection. And I have my Elfs. And right here are my higher end lip glosses. MAC, a um, variety of different brands, MAC. Smashbox and NARS and back here I have lip liners and also some more lip balms and different varieties and yeah all that great stuff so that's what that looks like and in here I have my blushes and bronzes and also skin finishes here are my MAC blushes different colors. The lid fell off of that one. Sad about that. I have also my um, 
Mac Studio Fix. And those are all those powders right there. I have my skin finishes right here. Also my Superwoman, I mean Wonder Woman. <laughs> Superwoman. Wonder Woman um thing right there. Also the Quella de not Quella de Villa. I don't know why I'm getting everything wrong. I forgot her name. Hello Kitty. And right here I have my bronzers. That's not a bronzer though. That's just one of the collections. I have my NARS and this is in the Super Orgasm. Also the MAC. I have my... What is this brand called again? Milani collection right here. Some jeans. Hard Candy, Hard Candy, NYX. Elf's. NYX all the way and these are pretty much all blushes hard candies right there um, physician's formula I believe this one's physician's formula too I don't remember who made that also some more bronzers in the back got this at a beauty supply store it's pretty awesome for glitter that glitter effect you want to look extra glam so that's what this drawer looks like. Blush and bronzer drawer. That's what I call that. I am going to start label label um, everything. And that is my collection. I hope that you enjoyed the video and I'll take some pictures so you could see how I organized everything. And like I said, um, you can find this drawer thing at um, Ikea and it's the Alex type of uh, style. That's what they're supposed to be called. I get my organizers at Target and also some of them were from Bath, Bed and Beyond. So yeah, don't forget to vote for me. Click the link down below if you haven't already. Okay, love ya. Later.